What is up you guys, my name is Akram and in today's video I'm going to be going over some things about my 2021 Toyota Tacoma short bed. Let's get right to it. So one of the first things you'll notice is when you actually open the bed, this lays down. It's not automatic, I don't know what you call it, it comes down smooth though, that's what it is. But obviously this Tacoma is a 5 foot bed and it's actually composite plastic. So right here under it, there's actually no metal. So this is just the composite plastic that it comes with. Still pretty durable. You know, I still like it, have no problems with it at all. All right, so the payload right here of the Toyota Tacoma is about 1,300 pounds. And the depth of it is gonna be 19 inches. The length is gonna be 60 inches, 0.5 and the width is gonna be 41.5 inches. All right, so when it comes to putting things in your actual truck and strapping them in, there's six built-in straps, which is gonna be one right here, two, three, four, and then five and six right there. But the actual truck comes with different types of straps you can actually put on the railing right here. So as you can see, those two right there, you can put basically as many as you want. They come with different types, and you know you can strap them, hook them, whatever you wanna do but it's basically super versatile as you can put as many as you want on this rail all you have to do is push this little thing in here take this piece off and put as many as you want in there now if you want to strap your items in your truck there's many different ways you can go about it you can get some of these straps with the ratchet wrench right here or you can get the bungee ones which just hook on to you know any part of the truck and they're actually elastic but i really recommend some of these right here i really like these how easy they are and they get it really tight and this one was actually four dollars but you can get you know some for a pack about 14 bucks and different things like that i'll put really good rated ones in the link in the description below and you guys can check that out so in the sr5 there's only one compartment on the 2021 i know some other models have different compartments and you know some of them have a small one on that side a plug on this side different things like that but this is what mine comes with and as you can see the compartment it's not that big but i mean it's all you really need for some straps you just turn this right here and you got as much room as you need for your straps so now i'm going to go over some mods that you know you can do and i did some of these to my truck but the first one is going to be getting a bed mat so over time with other tacomas i've noticed that they get a lot of white scratches when you tend to put lots of things in your bed so a bed mat is something that's going to help you prevent those scratches as you can see i have some on the back right there and it's also going to help you if you put lots of things in here they're not going to be sliding around you put them on the bed mat and you know it's obviously just going to stay there also if you do with paint or anything that's going to stain you know your truck as well this is going to help you so now when it comes to lights you do have right here this one that turns on it's an led and it's aiming down so you can see actual things in your bed the switch for that is on the left side and the passenger on the driver's side but you can actually get aftermarket right here i know some you know trds come with it but mine doesn't and mine comes with these little plastic you know caps right here where you can actually put the light right in here and also one on this side and then you can wire it right up and there'll be leds to light up your truck something else you can get is a bed cover or a tanu cover and what this is is it just covers your whole entire bed from you know the front to the back and some people say it actually helps with gas mileage I used to have one on here, but I realized that I actually don't see a need for it and what I use the truck for. But if you see a need for it, there's many different types out there. There's some hard ones, there's metal ones, there's you know roll ones that are plastic. There's a whole bunch of different types that range from the $300 to the $3,000 range. Overall, there's a lot of things you can do, especially if you're trying to overland. You can get that big frame right over here. There's a lot of storage compartments that have sliding features and things like that. Lots of different things you can do for your truck. You just have to go out there and research. I'll leave some links of some really nice things that I see down in the link in the description below. You can check those out on Amazon and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you can please help me out by giving me a like and a subscribe, I really appreciate it. Thank you guys and have a good day.